beauties and girls it is melissa q welcome back if you're new thank you to all my new subscribers and if you're an og you know how we roll if you're new don't forget to hit the subscribe button on your way out and hit the notification bell it's gonna let you know that i post videos every week i've been giving some bonus videos so every monday wednesday and friday at 6 p.m i post a video but i have been giving some extra videos so this one is i think is going to go up a little bit earlier just because this is valentine's day and i want to enjoy it with my family it is time for if see a glam bag unboxings or unbaggings and this is for the month of february i thought that this was so so cute especially today is valentine's day my hubby already gave me my valentine's okay and uh it's date night okay he knows the favorite chocolate and i have some gift cards we're gonna have a date night and yeah got me my favorite coffee some things like that thank you boo but anyway let's get into this unbagging so the first item that I actually did not try, but you know, at the end of the month, in my favorites videos, I let you guys know what I thought about the products. I feel like that that gives me enough time to get an impression, uh, not a, necessarily an impression, but I have about two to three weeks to work with to see what I like about these products instead of giving a first impression, which can be deceiving sometimes. So this is the meteor shower by black so this basically is a excuse my nails y'all because i'm doing my nails today before my date well i'm not really going on a date tonight we're going this weekend but anyway i'm doing my nails later but anyway this is a meteor shower by black i have tried their face mask and it's pretty good this one is for the body i did not use it today in the shower but it's okay because i'm going to use it and at the end of the month i'm gonna let you guys know what i think about this the next one is a luxie brush this is the 249 i love double ended or dual ended uh brushes so this one is a blending brush this is a flat edge i did use it in the tutorial as you saw i love luxie i don't doubt that i won't like this but i will let you know what i think about this brush in the video or i'll let you know what i think about this brush in my favorites video for february and then the next item that i used was the marsh this is their foiled again uh this is the for foiled again eyeshadow i have it on today it did have a little bit of fallout so i do recommend putting on your eyeshadow first i did my foundation first but it wasn't bad where i had to wipe it away it was a little fallout and i just um when i did my concealer it kind of wiped it away but i really did like this for the first time it um i didn't get that much fallout but as you could tell i sprayed my brush i do love the look that it gave and the glitter is a little bit chunky, but it reminds me of the Stila, the glitter and goes and those type of ones that I have. But I really like this and I'm considering I don't think I have anything like this in my collection. So I am thinking about keeping this if I'm going to use it a couple more times. And um, I really like the color. So this would be an ideal for a New Year's or a, a sparkly look for holiday thank goodness it is I can get away with this it being Valentine's Day but yeah uh, so far I like this okay so the next item I used was the IBY and this is the radiant glow highlighter in 24th 24 karat magic and this is such a pretty it's like a rose gold although it says 24 karat it looks rose gold which is totally on my alley and this is how it looks i did put it in my inner corner and on the cheeks the nose my cupid's bow and my chin and i really like that this is like it melts into the skin and it's a soft it's a soft one so it's a soft how can I say <laughs> it's a soft highlighter and I do like that this is compact so I really do like this we'll just see how long it lasts but usually highlighters especially if I set them they last pretty long and I love the sheen that it gives me it doesn't give it ashy but it does it is beaming I bet you I can make this look soft too so we'll try this and see how it works and then finally I've used this mascara before and I really like it this is the pure fully charged that's one of the things that you can ensure that you won't really have to get any more mascara if you have a beauty subscription especially ipsy or boxycharm but fully charged i like this it is buildable i love the wispy look that it gives my lashes um it gives more length to me than volume though um but it 
does give a good hold and it's not hard to take off at the end of the night. So I do like this and uh, this one has magnetic technology. That's one of the things about Pure Cosmetics. You can expect something a little bit different. So I really do like my overall look. So I hope you guys enjoyed this unbagging and try on for Ipsy Glam Bag for the month of February. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe and I'll see beautiful you in the next video.